This is the story of Marcus Johns and the five stages of grief he experiences during his wonderful tragedy. Yo, I really have to pee. Can we please just pull over right here? And at this precise moment, Marcus Johns had realized something had gone terribly wrong. And so began the inner workings of... Oh my God, it makes no sense at all. Freak it. Freak it. I was just here. Wait, I've seen this tree before. I have seen this tree before. Because I, I... No, hold on. Did I just make a giant circle? Oh no, wait. No, there's no way, because I, I came through this. Hold on, am I lost? No, no. No, there's no way I'm lost. There's no way I'm lost. There's no way I'm lost because I've seen that tree and it's only been five minutes. I, I came through here. I, okay, hold on. Where's the North Star? Why are... Okay, hold on. No, did I just make a huge circle? There's no way I just made a huge circle because I just came from up there. I came from up there and I'm fine. Everything is good. We're all good. I'm fine. I'm not lost. I've seen that tree before. And unknowingly, there began Johns' journey. Deeper and deeper into the wilderness. Further and further into his stages of grief. Tension grew as Jones realized he had been betrayed by mankind's inherent stubbornness. One can only walk so far for so long without expressing feelings of... What a little baby.
Lord. Please help me. Get me out of here. I promise I'll call my mom every day. No matter the case, God does not work like a vending machine. You don't just put in coins and get out what you want. There's a process, a plan. I would be one to know. Man should not be left alone with his thoughts for too long. This made evident as our main character has taken a turn for the worse. Marcus Johns had traveled, he had seen, he had been, and like most, he did not previously know of a test as difficult as this. But as his journey grew, he too grew into his unwavering Storms acceptance. Heartaches and pain will fade 